who knows what the best bait um, of all is. Any, any, any ideas? Squid, fish oil, and soft bait. <laughs> <laughs> It's something you probably wouldn't dream of using for bait because it's probably too good. Mussels? Mussels are good, yeah. yeah. Uh, power? Uh, power is okay. Sure. Right, but keep going up the ladder. Sure. Yeah. Oysters? Uh, if you're getting there, but yes. keep going up. What's your, what's your ultimate, really? Caviar? No. <laughs> <laughs> Not quite that much. Crab, very, very close. Crayfish. Crayfish, that's the one. Yeah. And, and I used to do a lot of serious. Uh, Competition fishing surf casting on a local fishing club here and also on a national level around the country. And whenever I was fishing competitions, I'd buy crayfish tails for bait because just our fish everybody using cray tails. <laughs> <laughs> I, spent, I spent thousands of dollars on crayfish you know, for years because I get a lot more fun going out fishing for five or six hours than I do sitting down for half an hour and having a feed. Um, and on one crayfish tail, I can catch half a dozen blue mokey or, you know. Or dozen terakee or half a dozen spotted sharks um, and give myself sort of six hours of pleasure or sitting down eating it but it's, it's hard to justify. And when I was a young fella, instead of going to the pub, spending a hundred bucks at the pub, I'd, I'd go down to the fish factory spend a hundred bucks on cray. That's for, for my weekend and go, go fishing with fresh cray or freshly snap frozen crayfish because it's just the yeah, official your mates and your wife, how I found it out. So I went out with guys using fresh cray and they outfished me, you know, ten to one right next to me, what are you doing, you know, oh nothing, you know, so you can have a look at them and and, uh, and you, you learn from experience and next next time I got myself fresh cray and I went out and, and caught lots of fish and a lot of the really good quality fish in Wellington um, eat crayfish. It's a little bit, fish, little bit different in here than, than you'll see in the magazines and on the fishing shows on TV uh, and books and stuff, the fishing in Wellington is sort of, it, it, it is it's sort of kept a wee bit sort of a is a secret. So this is a sort of set my bait for a, <laughs> off the boat for a, um, for a kingfish.